Hi, I have a very uh, exciting and very useful uh, video uh, session on how to uh, do a try by written decoration if you live in uh, a Los Angeles area and maybe other you know California or even other state areas might be similar but it is pertaining to primary Los Angeles County area so we got a ticket uh, traffic ticket due to uh, you know the, the officer claimed that we did not make a complete stop at a intersection but we did actually we uh, we were following the other car we made a complete stop we saw the police officer I think he made a mistake and he you know maybe he because uh, we had to stop because there was a car in front of us anyway so we're gonna do a uh, try by decoration you can also have an option of uh, go to court on your traffic ticket they will give you a court location and the due date or the the date to appear at a court you can do that as well but if you want to save time and hassle uh, you know you can do a try by written decoration process so you can come to this uh, you can go to lacourt.org and come to this page and then print out uh, instruction uh, right here it will give you more instruction on how to do it uh, let me do that so this is the uh, the detail you can you can read and you can uh, put in your statement okay so so you go through and read all of this you can pause this anyway um, so the next step is of course you want to actually uh, first of all you want to find out you know uh, if your ticket is online um, you it takes about 30 days to show up online so you might have to wait like 30 days when the officer gave you the ticket and you can come to this uh, location here and then you can put in your citation number for example right here you can pick the court case uh, the courthouse location a bunch of them here uh, and this information will be on your uh, ticket so you can pick a you know your location there whatever our will be metal courthouse and then you can uh, actually the officer is a highway patrol so California patrol and then you can put your ticket here now below here and then your uh, death of birth here and then do a search and then we'll search your ticket and we we'll give you the, the detail of the, the bail amount all of that stuff so I'm not gonna go through our ticket here but then you will come to um, let me see if I can uh, click on here uh, and then you will have to fill out TR200 form okay let me do that sorry not this one apologize let me go back actually you will do TR205 here this form here right here and by now you should know your ticket number you're gonna fill out your ticket number here but first of all fill out your your court location here right here right whatever it is uh, uh, LA Metro courthouse something like that the address here blah 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 and then you fill out your name here for okay, John Doe something like that citation one, two, three, four, five, blah 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 here case number if you don't know just leave it blank you don't need to fill out the bail amount if you know uh, from the system you could be I don't know $200 or something like that and then again you put in the uh, the LA Metro uh, courthouse address here street number I think it's something with Hill Street Oops. You can write as well. So I think it's you something here. I'm not gonna go ahead and be out here. Yeah. Just put them out here, the address. Okay. So you can skip all of these unless you have uh... but anyway, I'm sure most of us don't have any of this evidence, so just leave them blank. And then you will come to second page. We are almost done. 
And then I think here, I cannot type in here. So here, people, if VS Defendant, you can probably have to print this out and write your name here. And then the case number, you don't know, just leave it blank. And then make sure you put in your address here, otherwise the court will not know where to send respond back. Complete address here. Okay, you can this address. And here, you will write down all of the stuff here. Don't try to go into too much detail, you know, just uh, basically so you can put your statement here, try not to go into detail too much, and then you want the officer to provide you uh, evidence, you know, so it basically force the officer to, to come up with his own actual evidence like video cam, all that stuff, photo. Now, importantly to know that the officer had to spend his own time doing this once you know, you submit the paper, it, it, the whole thing might take like 30 days, but anyway, during, during that time, the, the clerk or the court will, send, will notify the officer to respond, but a lot of time, based on what I know, uh, the officer doesn't have time or he doesn't want to take his own time to do this. Versus, if you show up in court, uh, the officer will get paid over time to show up, but with the written declaration, the officer had to use his own time to do this, and a lot of time, he, I hopefully he will not do it. So that will give you a better chance of, of, of winning the case. So uh, you can put your, uh, you know, short statement here, precise statement here, or whatever that you. Uh, in our case, we, we're going to basically say that we, we saw the officer, we came to a complete stop, you know. So uh, please provide evidence, blah, 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 and then make sure you sign and date here, okay? Sign your name here, and date here, sign and then date it, uh, I don't know if that's, uh, um, oh, sorry, that's the date here, for example, today, you can put in uh, 25, for example, okay? Make sure you date it, your name, and sign it, okay? And I think that's pretty much it. You, you print this out, mail it to the court. Uh, just make sure you have your citation number and everything very important. Uh, and then, it, again, it might take about 30 days for them to respond back. So I want you to do this right away. Don't wait. And if you, whoever the court, you know, did not approve or file you guilty, you have a right to appeal uh, and you know for another court date. Let me see uh, what it say here. So if you fail, you can request what is called uh, a new trial, try de novo, something like that, within 30 days after the court decision. Then you can show up in court and give your, you know, your, your statement at the court. But you take your, your time away from work and all of that. But hopefully, uh, we'll let you folks know how it goes with our case. And hopefully everything will go well. I'm sure you have a lot of questions and concerns. Please put comments below and then I will be happy to, to answer them. So good luck. And we'll, I'll, I, like I say, I will give you folks an update how things go. And during this case, or uh, trap, uh, well, uh, this time, oops, you don't have to make any payment until you, your court, uh, you know, hopefully not find you guilty and you have to pay anything. But if you're guilty, they will instruct you to pay it. Uh, you can pay by check or online or by phone. So hopefully it helps and we'll see you folks uh, on the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.